Hello everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to my channel. In a very exciting news, Fish Audio has released the next version of their Fish Speech model. If you have been watching my channel, you know that I already have covered various models from this company including the previously released Fish Speech 1.4 and that was one heck of a model in terms of quality. This model the new one, the Fish Speech 1.5, has also been trained on more than 1 million hours of audio data in multiple languages, which include English to Chinese, Japanese to German, various other European languages, Arabic, Russian, Dutch, Italian, Portuguese, and few others. Now, in this video, we are going to install it locally, and then we will see how it works. One of the best things about these fish speech model which I always talk about is that there is no phoneme dependency because the model has strong generalization capabilities and does not rely on phonemes for TTS or text to speech. It can handle text in any language script by the way. Phoneme is a unit of sound in a language that distinguishes one word from another. It's a fundamental concept in phonetics and phonology. Phonemes are the smallest unit of sound that can change the meaning of a word. For example, we have P and B. And these are different phonemes in English. Because P, for example, we say pat or bat. They sound similar, but they are different. And for a TTS model, to distinguish between them, it's a hard challenge. That is where this model has no dependency on them because it uses its own algo and that is how its performance is quite good. Also, we will be uh, using a web UI interface which is a Gradio based user interface which works with a lot of browsers. You can also do it command line which I already have done in other videos if you're interested. So let's go and try to get this thing installed. Before I go, let me do um, a huge thanks to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on very affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description and I am also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on a range of GPUs so do check them out. This is my Ubuntu system as usual and this is my GPU card courtesy Mast Compute NVIDIA RTX A6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM. Let me create a virtual environment. Okay, so let's get started. First up, we need to install some of the audio libraries which include Lipport Audio 2 and Pi Audio. Let's get them installed. That is going to take a few seconds. That's done. Let's install all the prerequisites which are usual suspects like Torch, Torch Audio, Transformers and Decord and stuff. And by the way, this model is a gated model. So what it means is you would need to go to Hugging Face website, login, log in, and then just accept uh, the license, which primarily says that you cannot use it for commercial purposes. And then grab your token from top right, just click here. And then from the settings, you would scroll to the left and then get your read token from here. I already have it, so I'm not going to do it again. Just going back there. Okay, so let's wait for this one to get installed. And now let's git clone the repo of fish speech and you can get it from the bottle card where I will drop the link in video's description. That is done. Now let's log into Hugging Face because for the gated models, we need to log in with this command. And this is going to ask us for the token which you can get from huggingface.co. From your profile as I showed you earlier, just paste the token, press capital Y and you are logged in successfully. Okay, now we need to download the model and we can use uh, again Hugging Face CLI to download the model and I'm just downloading this fish speech 1.5 and I'm putting it in the local directory. And you can see that the model is not that huge. There's a decoder and then there is actual model just over 1.28 gig. Let's wait for it to get downloaded. And the model is downloaded as you can see in the fish speech directory. Let's clear the screen. Now in order to run the web UI, all you need to do is to run this command. 
by the way if you don't have a gpu then you can remove this dash dash compile then because it compiles it with the cuda so let me run it and while running that tool web ui.py you might get this error um, that no module named lightning for that all you need to do is to just run this pip install lightning and that should install lightning for you so let me do that and that is done let's rerun that web ui again with the compile option and now it is loading the model so let's wait for it and there you go so our gui is now running on our local host at port 7860 so let me take you to browser and open it there and there you go there is our fish speech running let me input some text here i'll just say hello how are you and then let me click on generate audio to generate it and it was fairly quick let me play it hello how are you <laughs> that is pretty crazy now we will get to it later but if you just scroll down a little you will see that um, you can even give a reference audio and by the way here in advanced config there are a lot of hyperparameters in order to see the prompt length and then repetition penalty and then controlling the output but let me click on reference audio you see that here we can upload an audio so let me upload an audio from my local system i'm just going to select an audio file from here let me quickly search for it i think i should have some audio file maybe i'll just go with uh, this this is an mp3 file i'll just play it what is happiness so i'll also just say it, what is happiness here and then we will just go up let's see i'll just keep this one as is let me click on generate let's play it hello how are you yes yeah, so it's a male voice and you see that it has used my reference audio and it did this but i don't think so it has cloned it that well let's also check how much vram it is using because the model is already loaded it's very very low just 2.6 gig um, or 2600 which is i think you can also run it on the cpu quite easily so in the next test what i have done i have just kept the reference uh, audio in my voice then i gave it a long paragraph and i have just put in calm voice here just to keep it calm let's click on generate i already generated it let me play it Calm voice. Happiness is a profound and multifaceted emotion that encompasses a range of positive feelings, including joy, contentment, and so fulfillment. See, it seems it has slowed down, so maybe I'll just remove this and then I will generate it again. And you see, the speed is quite good, that I really like about it let's wait for it there you go happiness is a profound and multifaceted emotion that encompasses a range of positive feelings include so you see now it has it is a normal it's not a slow voice so maybe i'll just say uh, sing let's generate it let's wait and i will let it run to show you the speed of it okay let's see what it does here seeing happiness is a profound and multifaceted emotion that encompasses a range of positive feelings it's okay, so different but not really there you see you can provide a reference audio but it doesn't matches with my voice as you already saw so voice cloning is paid off in this one uh, for some reason i think that 1.4 the previous version was better in terms of cloning and other stuff 
i am not sure um but this one is also not bad especially i think the speed in this one of generation is better but the cloning is not that good in my opinion okay now i have used another audio source with the same paragraph let me play it a little slow happiness is a profound and multifaceted emotion that encompasses a range of positive feelings including joy contentment and fulfillment it is a fundamental interesting so all in all not a bad model of course given the size and everything but i think cloning can be improved a lot let me know what do you think about this fish speech 1.5 if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you are already subscribed please share it among your network as it helps a lot thank you for watching